a key issue as far as the tyrosine kinase inhibitors uh, is when uh, imatinib becomes generic because uh, the uh, cost of care of patients with CML, uh, considering there are about uh, 80,000 patients with CML receiving TKIs today, is the cost of the drugs on an annual basis, and that could amount to several billions of dollars. So once uh, imatinib uh, comes in a generic formulation that could reduce the cost of such therapy down to 10% of its actual price, and then one has to discuss what potential benefits we would like to see with the second tyrosine kinase inhibitors for them to uh, continue to be frontline therapy. Um, ultimately, what we would like to see is a significant difference in the five to 10 year survival when we give these patients nilotinib or desatinib as opposed to a generic imatinib. Alternatively, we would like to see a significant difference in the event-free survival or transformation-free survival uh, that could be clinically meaningful for that kind of a difference in the cost of care.